Welcome back dear friends and followers, I am back with my another video. So Christmas is coming and you are tired of searching that how you can make a Christmas light show at home. So don't worry, your search ends here. In this video, I will be going to give you step by step guide that how you can make a DIY Christmas light show at home. It's very easy to make and it's very cheap to make. I have already created a video on this topic but many of you are facing problems like that. Relays are not reacting to the effects in the Vixens. So I will show you a fix of that, that how you can fix that. So before we start, make sure to subscribe to my channel and let's get right into it. So first thing first, launch your Vixen software. Select setup display. From here select generic serial, add it and name it anything like garage controller. Okay. Add number of outputs. I am adding here 8. Okay. Now configure it. To configure, select your COM port. This all will remain same and bot rate also remain same. Okay. Most important thing that all of you are missing is write this header this is very important to start a communication between your Vixen software and your Arduino so type this header and there will be a communication between your Arduino and Vixen software click on ok and it's very simple this is the only step you have to do now click ok now your controller has been set up now in the code part here you have to define number of channel you have for example you have to 8 channel relay it can handle it cause it's 16 channel if you want to control more relays you need to change it to anything like if you are using 40 relay click here 40 and if you are facing a problem like when you put a effect and relay turn off instead of turning on it turns off and turns on when there is no effect so you need to change mode to inverted uh, change them to inverted there are three mode in the code you need to change all that to inverted if you are facing that problem and compile this sketch and it should be compiled now to add your elements click on single item add name it i am naming it fountain okay now they are single color okay okay now right click on that add multiple i am adding eight elements here okay now to patch them to controller just select them all click on your controller and type and click patch elements they will patch to each other like you can see here they are patch point to point with each other now relay and audio connection are very simple we just need to connect it in the CL like in 1 to 8 will connect from 2 to 10 like this you need to add it in the serial order like this now connect your audio to your computer Make sure to connect your make sure to connect your Arduino before launching Vixen. Yes. After connecting your Arduino to your after uploading your code and connecting Arduino to your PC, then launch your Vixen software. Now here you can see random sequence is going on again. Now, as soon as I launch Vixen, this light should stop. See, Vixen is launched 
and this this light is blinking continuously that means it is connected to vixen uh, see vixen is launched and all lights on the relay turned on it's uh, this is how it should be As you can see, I have added a change effect to the front fountain and a corrected front fountain to my controller in the garage controller.